Hi, my name is Rob Zimmer, and I've been living in Imperial Valley for more than 50 years. I come from a family of farmers. My dad was an entomologist and graduated from Cornell University. I graduated with a degree in plant science. I've had a business down here for 30 years, and for more than eight years of it, I was public information officer for the county of Imperial. In my days, Wayne Vandegraaff was the one that got me to do this, and he assigned me to work on the wastewater treatment plants in Mexicali, and he also asked me to work on the salt sea. I have witnessed firsthand what the salt sea was in the past and what it is today. I know the decades of farming's wastewater, also known as tailwater, has deposited in the salt sea, California's largest inland body of water. In early valley farming years, DDT was a commonly used pesticide that, in the 1970s, due to its harmful health effects, was banned from use. Agricultural wastewater containing DDT combined with other heavy metals and prostates create a toxic mixture you do not want to become airborne.